In order to perform a Promax potentiometer calibration, also known as a SCARA arm calibration, you're going to need both of the Promax calibration pins. First, make sure that the Promax is powered on and lower the Promax down to a comfortable working height. We're going to be accessing the top of the Promax, so the further down the better. Next, go ahead and take off the shoulder arm cover by gently pulling up on the bottom edges. Now keep in mind, some Promax models have a locking bolt on the shoulder that you need to loosen with a three millimeter Allen key in order to remove the cover, so be careful. Next, go ahead and fold the temple supports out of the way and remove the chin adapter from the Promax. Touch on the wrench icon on the ProTouch display Go to your technical tab, type in the password 1701, hit the green check mark, go to your calibration menu, go to the SCARA arm menu, and finally SCARA arm calibrations. Next, touch the drive to pinpoint button to move the Promax to its last known pin position. If you see all three of the numbers are green, you know that the potentiometers are within calibration range. Next, locate the elbow pinpoint on the Promax and gently insert the pin. If the pin does not slide down into the Promax, it may be necessary to release the motors and adjust the arm as necessary until it becomes fully inserted. Next, put the pin in the shoulder joint and gently slide it down until it's fully inserted. Keep in mind, on certain Promax models, like the Promax Mid and Plus, the pin will not slide down completely, so be aware of that. Next, toggle your release motors button on and off a few times to relax the motors around the pins. Make sure that your motors are locked and then gently pull the pins out of the calibration points. At this time, make sure that nothing is around the Promax so that it can move freely and go ahead and touch automatic position sensor calibration button to begin the POTS calibration. This can take about 15 minutes, so leave the Promax alone, let it rotate around and do its thing, and do not touch the arm while it's moving. Should you need to interrupt the calibration, please do so by powering the Promax off. Do not hit the emergency stop switch. Once the SCAR arm has stopped moving and the please wait message is no longer on the ProTouch display, turn the Promax off and back on again to complete the calibration process.